On the CircuitPython Parsec today, I want to talk about getting the distance between two points on a touch screen. So this, first of all, I'd like to say was inspired by the spirit board, uh, Ouija board type of project that Tim Foamy Guy just uh, released recently. Super cool project. And I was looking at it and I said, hey, there's a bunch of neat little nuggets in here. I'd like to bust out a couple of them and show them on their own. So one of the things he does in that is uh, figures out the distance between two points on the screen so that he can then move the uh, little pl planchette, the little uh, uh, cursor essentially on the project. So what I'm doing here is I've got a Pi portal and you can see when I start this up, it says uh, touch the screen twice to find the distance between points. So I'll touch once and you'll see it it uh, spits out both in my REPL and on the screen there. Point one is at 272 on the x-axis and 40 on the y-axis. And then I'll touch a second time. And it says point two is at 34 and 175. The distance between those is 273 units. So that's roughly pixels, I think, in this case. It's also uh, more accurately uh, touch screen units, and I'm going to play around with this in future episodes and, and determine exactly what units we're looking at there. Uh, but the main thing here is that we're able to use the Pythagorean theorem to determine the distance between two points on a 2D plane. The way this is done is I'm importing the time, board, math, and touchscreen libraries. I initialize the touchscreen, and then I have this function. This is the key thing here. This is the Pythagorean theorem. It says uh, function is dist in, and then we have two inputs, point A and point B. Those are tuples that have the X, Y, and pressure. We don't really need the pressure, so we're really just going to use the X, Y of two different points. And then you can see here it says to calculate the distance between the two points, the tuple point A is the X, Y pair of the first point, and the B is the X, Y pair of the second point. So we are then casting A, X, that's first point X, and A, Y, that's first point Y, as point A. I'm also grabbing the pressure there even though we're not going to use it. And then for the second point, B on the X and B on the Y is point B. And then this is what we're returning. The integer of math.square root of second point X minus first point X squared plus the second point Y minus the first point Y squared. And that gives us the distance between those two points. Uh, then in the main loop, all we're going to do is check for the screen being touched. If it gets touched, then we take the P1 variable and switch it from none to being whatever that touch point was, and we print that out. Uh, and then we just have a little debounce time in there. We look for a second press in case P1 has already been touched. Then we know as, as the state of that, we can fill that second variable. So P2 is equal to the touch point. And then we go ahead and say distance is equal to this function up here, dist point A, point B. And then we print that out and I'm doing a little bit of um, fancy uh, interface stuff there to put a number of dots that's equal to uh, a tenth of the uh, actual distance number just because we don't have enough screen space to do the actual distance number without looping that a bunch of times. And so that is how you can get the distance between two points on a touch screen inside of CircuitPython. And that is your CircuitPython Parsec.